Hello guys and girls, so today this video is about the Kenobi series. I just wanted to let all of you know I've watched the last episodes of Kenobi and I absolutely love it. So in this video it's going to be my honest review. So with the fight scenes, I thought it was fantastic. It was quite emotional with some of the scenes. And I'm uh, on the edge of my seat um, when watching it, so it's very like, thrilling so it was like you know you can wait to what hap you can wait to see what happened next so then um so yeah it was a great episode and i hope there is i hope there's going to be a season two because it's been rumored that there is going to be and semi-confirmed i guess but um also i would like to see what the um how far they go with Raven's story if you have watched um, Kenobi, obviously don't watch this video. Well, there's not going to be a lot. Of, there's not going to be any spoilers in here. But um, yeah, so if you've watched that episode, let me know if you've enjoyed it in the comments below. But not in too much depth, like you know, no opinionated comments. Or you can, but just don't mention anything that happened in the episodes. Um, and the reason why I do these videos is because I love. Um, covering all the Star Wars, Star Wars series and also so I let you know that I've watched them so you don't accidentally spoil it for me and all of you obviously enjoy the type of videos which I do so a lot of you enjoy the Kenobi videos I do so my honest review is a 100 out of 100 because I absolutely loved this episode and I thought this was like one of the best episodes or maybe in the top tier three so i think episodes four five and six in my opinion was all my favorite episodes but the whole series as a whole was um i loved all episodes but my favorites definitely has to be um episode six so uh six five and four but then also three is one of my favorites and i absolutely love all the storyline and stuff uh, and storytelling going on with this series. And I like I said, I hope there's a sequel. Because it's been rumoured that it is. Um, but I hope it is true. And I hope it does become true. Because I absolutely love the series. And I love the story of all the characters in the series. There is a bit of sad bits. Which in one of the episodes I started crying after one, one scene. I think you know which one I'm going on about. Um... If you've watched it, obviously you'll know which one I'm going on about probably. And if you haven't watched it, um, I basically just go and watch the series. It's fantastic. <sighs> Sorry. Um, so like I said, I absolutely love this episode. I give it 100 and out of 100 review. And I absolutely... Um, wait a minute. And I absolutely recommend watching this series or watching this episode if you are not if you haven't already. I know a lot of people already have watched it, but then the problem is when Kenobi comes out to eight o'clock. So I'm normally in school by then, or no, no one comes out at eight o'clock. So I'm in school at eight thirty till like half past three, quarter past three. Um. So then basically, a lot of you watch all the series in the day, but then I watch it in the evening because I don't have time with school and stuff like that. So that's why I stick away from like all social medias. So Instagram is one of them. YouTube, I don't really stick away from it. I just watch the review videos of the episodes and ones which obviously go full into detail. So a lot of spoilers in. I watch them after I watch the episodes, just so if I miss anything when I watch the episodes, I know um if I've missed anything. And if you've already watched the series, can you tell me what your favorite episode is? Like I say, not in too much detail. Sorry. Um, so basically not in too much detail or just say like episode one, two, six are your favourite or like, you know, so like you liked all of them. I absolutely loved all the episodes and I loved the ending of this episode. So if you watched the episode, you would know what I mean by the ending. Um... And I absolutely love all the hard work and I appreciate all the hard work which Disney and Lucasfilm has put into the series. 
and I'm really impressed by Deborah Chow's directing and Ewan McGregor's acting as usual because I absolutely love um Ewan McGregor. He's a great actor, and also Hagen Christian, Hagen Christensen, and Moses Ingram. She's a fantastic actress. And I absolutely love her acting and her character in a series. Her character is very interesting. Um, but I'm not going to say what her character is, just in case you haven't watched the series at all. But I would highly, highly recommend watching the series. And I can't wait until it ever to come out. Sorry. Um, and I can't wait until the other series come out, like Andor, Ahsoka, uh, Skeleton Crew... And a bunch of other series. I can't wait until all of them come out. And hopefully Star Wars films are going to, going to be coming out in a couple of years. Time. So it's Taika Waititi. I can't remember. I can't pronounce his name properly. Um, His Star Wars film coming out. I don't think it's this year. I think it's either next year or 2024, I think. But yeah, so I can't wait until his film. And... Yeah, and I absolutely love Star Wars. So Star Wars is one of my favourite franchises out of a lot of things. But um, obviously for some casual fans, with some of the Obi-Wan Kenobi series, it is some uh, flashbacks or like hints towards other bits in Star Wars history, so all the different trilogies, stuff like that, and events. And this is where I'm going to end the video. Okay, bye.